Hi, I'm Matthew. Welcome to my channel, and today it is time for a shave. A late Sunday shave. Real quick, I'm going to wet my face. Well, I just got out of the shower. I wet my face. And I'm ready to talk about the shave soap. Today's shave soap is by Phoenix Artisan Accoutrance. And this is Blue Salmon. Some people say Blue Salmon. Blue Salmon. This is a nice scent. I really enjoy this scent. It's got a burnt sugar scent to it. There's some bourbon in there. And a nice combination or matching scent of like a sandalwood and a pumpkin. And it's got that kind of sweet, boozy scent to it. And I do enjoy it. I am going to use the matching cube. I actually forgot I had this. I was kind of tucked away in some of the things I had back there. But, oh yeah. I do have that whipped up already in my Captain's Choice Copper Bowl. And you know what? I think I'm going to have to break down and get the Star Jelly when it comes out this year. Because it's nice. It's a nice scent. And I'm using my beautiful black classic Trotter's Handcraft brush. And these brushes have no problem whipping up the lather. Very nice. I'm going to have to do a video on why I enjoy the Trotter's brush. Because I've probably never really talked about all the different things that make me feel like it is the best brush around. And of course, when the shaving world, this is my opinion, and yours may vary, but... If you're wrong about it, you're just wrong because this is an excellent brush. <laughs> the uh, razor that I'm going to be using is the PAA Prismatic. And I really like the scalloped head and the scallop bar on here. The handle, I kind of wish it had a little bit different handle. And sometimes when I use this, I'll swap it out with a different handle. But today I'm going to use the regular handle and I forgot to tell you I've got three days worth of growth and I'm needing a haircut. Oh yeah. So very uh, simple, nice razor and the blade that I'm going to be using today is going to be the Gillette Nasset. There you go. And this particular blade had a lot of glue dots on it. And this will be the last use for this particular blade. I've got three shaves on it, or this is going to be the third shave. And so I'm not going to push it too far past that. And if you guys have seen me use this razor in the past, the tabs do stick out right there, if you can see it. So if you're an unwieldy shaver, caution to you, sir because you may cut your nose or ear. All right, so let's go ahead and warm up the razor and let's get the shave going. I really like the feedback that this razor provides. And it has no problem mowing down three days worth of growth. The one thing that's uh, really nice about this razor is there's really not a whole lot of blade feel to it. And I honestly like this a little bit better than the Metaphor razor. Shockingly enough, I had that razor and it is no longer with us. It had to go down the road. I picked this one over that one. And I needed a shave. I got busy doing some other stuff. And you know how time escapes you? Yep, 
You know one thing I didn't escape? The gravity razor. Oh, whew. man, I thought I needed stitches on that, dude. But luckily... I survived. Wow. For the price of this razor, it's actually pretty inexpensive. And I don't really hear too many people raving about it, you know? And, you know, it's, uh, how can I say it? It's kind of, I won't say an underdog, but, and, and I won't say it's underappreciated, but for what you get, it really gives an excellent shave. I'll say this razor is probably looked over. That's what I want to say. Yep. And I'm going to go ahead and get lathered up for pass two and just because i used uh i think my ratio is right but i'm going to add a little bit of water here just because um i used the cube and i know that my face is you know drying up a little bit so and you know what they say water equals slickness <laughs> I have my rinse bowl here that is, look at the lather on that. Yep, it's not bad. I used a quarter of a teaspoon with the 13 milliliters of water. And it did the trick. You can see how adding water on that for the second pass kind of thinned it out a little bit. Which is what I'm going for because I want to get a nice close shave. All right, here we go across the grain on pass number two. Mm -hmm. No problem rinsing out the razor. And that's why I like to have my lather a little thinner. In the beginning, when I first started wet shaving, I really liked the thicker lather. But I did notice it was more difficult to rinse. And if you're in the shower, that's probably why, another reason why I like the thicker lather because uh, I was in the shower and you know, you got the water all over the place. Mm -hmm. So I've been taking a little break off of social media and Instagram and all that because sometimes it's just a little overwhelming with all the look at me's and so I just kind of not been hanging out there too much. Plus, you know, people want to enable you to buy more things <laughs> and I've been holding back. Holding back from buying. And I've been doing a pretty good job. So, all right, let's take a little feel here. Plenty of residual slickness. And wow, that razor did an excellent job. I'm going to get cleaned up with some cold water and I will be right back. I am back. And wow, what a shave. I'm going to be drying off with the Lancaster Black Sheep towel. And I really enjoy using these towels. I know I tell you guys that all the time, but when it comes to uh, the rapid moisture absorption and when you're cleaning up your uh, gear, it works really well. I'm gonna use the matching splash. Oh yeah. I actually have the bar of soap for this, and the bar of soap does lather. I know some of the other uh, bars that I've gotten didn't quite lather like this one, 
not this one because this is star jelly but uh yeah for whatever reason that one the lather cometh from within oh yeah <laughs> all right well that is the shave for the day and wow does that feel nice i needed a shave and uh just having all that stuff gone all right well i will put a picture right here of the items that I use today, and I will see you guys on Wednesday for Will It Shave Wednesday. You have a great rest of your weekend.